and welcome back guys. So we're going to be doing some questing today. Make sure it's the like button, make sure it's the subscribe button. Not sure if it's going to be main questing or side questing. I know we need to do, go ahead and get some of these anchors unlocked. But first I want to move the base. So I'm thinking, you know, maybe moving my base over here because I've got a side quest here, I've got a side quest here, I've got a side quest there. So somewhere around here would be good. It looks like water and it doesn't look polluted. So I think that's going to be the first thing we do before we go into any questing is to find a new base location. As much as I love this spot for my base location, it is too far away from all these quests and it's cost me a penny to get around. So, and I marked out a spot down here that had a bunch of resources. The only thing is it's not close to water. That's the only issue I had with it. Where was it? It's right there. It has tons of resources here. It's just not close to water. Which is not too much of an inconvenience. I can literally come right back here. Like having a base anywhere, either in here or even back here, wouldn't be terrible. But that's what my plan is. So I'm gonna go ahead and go back this way. Go put my base over here somewhere. I mean, this is kind of cute. I just don't think my base is going to fit over here. I'd prefer it to be near some ore nodes. Oh, let's look around. Alright, we got some ore nodes there. Got some metal. Got some trees. You know, I'm gonna try it. I kind of liked it over there because it had a lot more ore, but... You know, let me chop this tree down and see what happens. Um, I actually need to see if there's any, like, wildlife over here. That might be important, too. Making sure that there's food. Food's kind of important. I do want to redo my base at some point. So I'll just keep this in mind. I have a frog now. It's mine. Alrighty. Not seeing much wildlife over here, which is concerning. It just means I'd have to go back and forth until I found bead. Yeah, I am gonna have to redesign my base because I need to include include farming. Well, maybe I can put my base over there. Mm -hmm. That's the only real decent flat spot, so that's why I'm like, eh, do I put it over there, or do I put it over here? This is nice and flat too. Oh, decisions. I don't want to be too close to them because I want to make sure they have plenty of build space. You can kind of see why I'm like, eh, I'm kind of hesitant to build close to them. I was hoping you could just walk right through. Alright, I guess we're gonna, I guess I'm just gonna loop with the spot over here. So I've never moved my base before, so this is definitely new. Oh, there's some food right there. Okay, this sounds so terrible. Could be better, but it's not so terrible. I can live with that. Let's just chop down some of these trees. I think these respawn, but we're about to find out. Okay, never mind. This is not really that flat. I thought it was flatter. Sorry, right. my base also has to be in the water a little bit, maybe. Let's see here. Yeah, they're going to get kind of pissy at me because now they get to look at my house. Uh. I want to be next to that because that makes it cheaper to teleport. Let's see here. 
They have a car. Jealous. Ah, okay. We got four over here. That's nice. Don't eat me, piggy. Go away. Oh, he wants a piece of me. He wants the whole damn thing. Fuck off. Give me your bacon. It looked at me funny. Uh, I guess I'm just gonna have to sell it for this spot. It's all right. It's not great. So I need to update my brew point before I bring the base over here. That might be important. So well. No, it should be fine. So B, build. Yeah, I'll have to update my blueprint because my base is not stone. So I've upgraded my base to stone. And it's coming up this wood for some reason. So we'll teleport back here in a second. I'm just gonna go update my blueprint and then I'm gonna teleport back here and we're gonna move the base and we're gonna see what happens. We're gonna see if the stuff stays in the boxes like it's supposed to. It should, but there's only one way to find out by doing it. Oh shit, hi. Uh, we're completely not where I want to be, so there's people built around here, and I thought we were closer to this. Alright. Learning as we go, learning as we go. Alright, time to fall out the fucking car. I was pissed when I found out that all the videos that I've done of me playing this game had copyright them, I'm like... Really? You know people are going to record the gameplay, and you put copyright music in the game. What the fuck? So, yep, that's why we don't have the radio on anymore. Can't have nice things. But right there would be kind of nice. Like, having it, like, close? Like, here? So, because the camp is right there, so if we put our base like right around here somewhere, even if it's in the water a little bit, that wouldn't be terrible. Oh, it's wolf. Down. Oh, I missed one. Down. Yeah, so we're on our way back to our base. I'm also just kind of looking to see where a good spot would be. Like right here, like just having it a little bit in the water, that wouldn't be too terrible. Or maybe I'll just stick it in the water. <laughs> this isn't. Okay, let's take a look what the other side's looking like. And then we'll teleport out. Keep forgetting you can teleport from the antennas. Uh, I mean, that side's flatter. That would be more ideal. But there's like no nodes over here. So, I get the little. Digibot, um, NPC. Like, right here would be alright. So, putting my base in the wire for right here. 
that uh, I can make that work. Let's just put a thing in here. This is where we'll put the base. If it will let me. To a store for now. Can I teleport? No. So this lake area is pretty much where all the people are just starting to play the game for the first time, hang out. It's a nice little spot, it's just, you know, when you start getting more quests, you gotta move your stuff out more. I need to go into building blueprints. We'll delete this one temporarily. And now we will... Save a blueprint. Confirm. Save all. Version 2. Base V2. And confirm. Now, when I teleport my base over there, I should be able to just select this. So, a couple things he missed from the last time. I ended up getting a fridge, which is really nice. And it keeps my food uh, good longer, which is nice. What's more, excuse me. I can now make these, and as long as I can make sugar, we're good. But uh, as soon as I can't make sugar, we're screwed. Alright, uh, it's gonna do something. Ah, yes, ammo. Well, I'm here. Prayer weapons. So the goal right now is to wait until the next season opens up, because I want to upgrade my weapons. And I don't know what the hell happened in the last couple videos, but I could have swear on that we were on season two. But I guess not. Oh my god, all my equipment's falling apart. So if I go over here, you'll notice that I want to upgrade to tier 5, but it requires aluminum ingot, which, in order to unlock aluminum ingot, come on over here, you'll notice, oh look, aluminum ingot, tame of steroids. Doesn't unlock until that comes up. So, come up here. Tame of story right here. So in 17 hours, I'll be able to access everything down there. So we're basically locked out of things we need to get. Just checking to see if anyone left me any new thingies. Oh, this is dope. Yeah, I got on today and I found out my neighbor there, that neighbor, the neighbor on the hill, that neighbor up there is gone, like, even the neighbor over there is gone. It's like, where'd everyone go? Alrighty, let's do this. Let's do the scary thing that we've never done before. Oh man. Target point locked? What do you mean it's locked? I want to teleport. I well, guess I'm teleporting from here to there, and then I'm driving back over. That's kind of annoying. Thank you. 
Supposedly you can move your base every 10 minutes. Supposedly. I don't know if that's true. But if I can slim my base down a little bit, then it will make it easier to move it around and get more resources that way. What I need to do is set up more wire catchers. This way there's more wire going into a wire storage module. This way when it rains, it's collecting me a lot more water. Uh, the reason I want to build it next to the water is I want to get the pump unlocked so that I can start pumping in the water and then get the osmosis system so that I can turn uh, dirty wire into purified water. You kind of get the idea. right there. It's kind of a nice spot. You got some cars right there that can loot for gas for the motorcycle. It's got a view too. The only difference that's here is there's not much wildlife. Shift plus, turn off, rotate. Proving to be a pain. So the issue I have here is I can't really see where the base is, and it makes it kind of difficult to see where it is. B. Z.
It's very finicky for some reason. That goes where I want it to go. It did, yay! Not exactly where I want it, but it's close enough. I can look that. Alright. And your answer is yes. Everything stays in the base. Um, yeah. I might want to patch my holes in my floor, huh? Well, that's kind of cool to have a hole in the floor. This is all because I was on that damn cliff. House modeling here. Uh, let's get rid of that. Oh, we'll just make this one air floor just different, you know. Two free clan, what are you talking about? Don't pull that bullshit. There we go. Doesn't look out of place at all. But yeah, I definitely want to rebuild this. Um, I want to have like a circle base. And then... What I can do is have the Star Forge inside, inside of something that's more defendable, I guess you could say. But I gotta finish off what I'm doing with this blueprint first. So I think for this video we're gonna do mostly just work on this and just get it to a point where I can say okay I built it I have it done in case I want to build again at some point. So I think that's what we're gonna do with this video. So we're gonna build. Okay why well, won't you let me place it there? I'm gonna place it there. You gotta make it upstairs to do it, aren't you? Oh. Had it for a second there. Come on. There you go. That's right, I never had my, uh, Pathways on the side, but I kind of like the other one better. Uh, having a star port or having a forge like out here instead of it next to the house would be good. Have it like right here. This way when I do waves of enemies trying to break in to steal the shit. Don't have to worry about it. 
adjust. Why won't you adjust, you bastard? Put it in this corner then. So what I'm doing is I'm building a thing to do the Star Forge, because eventually I am going to need to use the Stardust Forge thingy, and I'm going to need to, uh, what's the best word for it, use it to get more stuff. So the idea of this is the turrets, when I do get them, will go on these little platforms here. You kind of get the idea of what I'm going for here. Alrighty, now that we have that set up, so this is where the turrets would go, this is where the sandbags would go, and the Star Forge, uh, that's why I'm calling it, will go in the middle there. And if I could, you know, go into build mode, that'd be great too. Right there. 
Then we're gonna build up again. I'm gonna use wood this time, because it's just cheaper. The wood scaffolding is temporary, it's not perm. Is that base always there? That looks like it's new. Oh, hi. Good job. I won't be going hungry. And it, I know it's a terrible thing to say, but it's true. So once I get the drill, it'll make life so much easier. Yeah, what I was noticing with my big base there is it's harder to place. I don't know if I like that. I'm just thinking if I do a circle base, it'll be easier to move around. So, we'll finish building this out. And pretty much after that, then I'll have a reason to bring it down to you having nothing. And I can rebuild it. But you gotta finish this out, we gotta stone all this up. Alright, mini bricks. So I should go into here. Sort that crap out first. Yeah, I don't know why it's doing that glitchy crap out there. It's kind of annoying. I know I don't know how to get rid of that thing over there. If you're wondering, Slank, like, hey, why haven't you got tried to get rid of that? Because I don't know how to. Yet. Significant space. No base. Did. 
There's plenty of space now. What are you talking about? Alright, we'll start a new box with just that stuff then. That's ore, that's crystal. Those rails were really starting to bug me. I'm gonna probably improvise and change that up. Uh... Compost bin to the rescue. see what we can make. Ooh, a Santee gummy, which is good. Hmm. Yeah, we'll put that in here. Oh no, oh, our salt is missing. You might want to fix that. That's not terrible. I'll have to see if I can do different rails. Alright, they're not full yet. Alright, let's see if I can do anything about this glitchiness going on out here. better, so...
I don't have it unlocked yet, do I? No, I do not. Alright. Could get the iron rail, but I'll be able to get something else once it becomes. Hmm. Yeah, fuck it. Still kind of glitches out. So I'm gonna go farm around a little bit, build up resources, get this built. When you see me in the next video, we'll go back to questing. I kind of want to get this set up so that when I do get other things unlocked, and I can swap to this blueprint and have this built, or I can finally break this all down, build this thing that won't go away. <laughs> it's kind of annoying having this blueprint inside of a house that you've already built that you can't cancel out. So you can kind of see it from my point of view of like, come on man, make this thing go away. Can't make it go away at all. Can't cancel it or anything. Anyways, make sure to the like button, make sure to subscribe button. Hopefully this was enjoyable to watch me build this. I'm gonna go ahead, farm some resources, and get everything that I need to finish off the little bit of building here, and then we'll go back to questing. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video.